Now to the latest on the coronavirus. Breaking Bad star Brian Cranston breaking good news. He's recovered from COVID-19. Brian saying he was lucky. He only experienced very mild symptoms. The Emmy winner sharing this video as he donated blood plasma in LA. I'm giving platelets today uh, because I have the antibodies. Country star Garth Brooks's youngest daughter, Allie, is also recovering from a mild case of the virus. Garth revealing that he and his wife, Trisha Yearwood, had to postpone their July 7th Facebook concert to quarantine after Allie tested positive. This week, several states are breaking records and not good ones. I just talked to our Insta MD about it. All right, so Dr. Dorian, you know this week that we had a pretty grim milestone, 150,000 confirmed coronavirus deaths by far the most of any country. So what are we doing wrong? If everybody would mask, sanitize, and distance, physical distancing, we would not need to have this type of casualty count. We're also hearing about the study that finds that three quarters of recovered coronavirus patients have heart damage months later. Yeah, so this is important information because a lot of people are like, hey, I'm not getting sick, so it's not a big deal. This inflammatory process, I guess the easy way of thinking about this is a fire. There's a mm -hmm. fire that is lit inside your body by this virus. And the burn that you experience sometimes will actually happen weeks to months later and in different organs that you probably didn't think of one of which is your heart and wow. obviously we know the heart is super important that consequence you don't want to suffer so that's why we're saying take this really seriously this new study that i heard that people who are over six feet tall they have double the chance of having a covid 19 medical diagnosis or testing positive because of aerosol transmission we do know that there are certain circumstances where the virus is aerosolized so what do we do with that information the public that is watching this now it's simple, mask. So don't freak out about your height. Just understand that this virus exists and mask. I want to end on a high note. We're hearing about a COVID-19 test that not only can potentially be conducted entirely at home, but within a half an hour. Is this a game changer? Home testing will be a game changer because I know there's a lot of people sitting at home right now saying, you know what? I might feel a little weak. I might have a few chills. Maybe I should get tested, but they don't go through the process of getting tested. And because of also asymptomatic spread, home testing is going to be a real game changer because we can then figure out who really is sick and isolate and get ahead of this. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.